we did it. On 8th November 2016, Android 17 CCD was successfully updated. It is stipulated. There's no restriction to the screen aspect ratio. On 27th March of this year, Google made clear in the Android developer's blog it is about to update your app to take advantage of the larger aspect ratio. Xiaomi Mix LG G6 Samsung S8 were inclu included. It looks quite simple for the customers. However, before we launch our product today, we take quite a long time until we finish our aspect. It's about the modification of a material standard. It's really in unimaginable for how much effort we put in. Today, 18 to 9 aspect could be a standard for all the supplies, but don't forget who was the pioneer. Of the year, we launched the concept of the full display screen, and some competitor claimed they did it before. I didn't care who did it first. I didn't care who was the inventor. What concerns me a lot is who is going to provide a better experience. However, when time permitted, I did a literature review and identified my role in reventing the concept of full size screen. I also did a discussion with Ali. This term might not be accepted by our potential clients, but gradually I realized this term or this terminology was widely accepted. As a pioneer, I feel quite lucky and comfortable. Now we're in the leading position to lead the train to up. Today we have different schools. My savings. My competitor is issuing the flagship design. They are maintaining the earphone sensors, cameras while narrowing the forehead, but we are in a different way. We we'll get rid of the foreheads and we are marching on two directions. And we have the third alternative choice. In the middle of the screen, they did a hole. Back in three years, we thought it over. We were also the first supplier to launch the round angles. However, we want to push on and forward. It might be three different trains of three different schools. Which one do you prefer? In the foreseeable future, the three models will be working together until finally two of the designs will be eradicated. We might do in the first approach to narrow the forehead or the second get a hole in the mid and the thirdly we almost eradicate the forehead. Among the discussions we follow the first generation of the mix. Which one do you prefer? As a client, I have a lot of confidence for my product, and I'm going to wait for the Apple's launch tomorrow. Uh, yeah, three types of both side screens. Online, I read a very interesting comic book. I talked to my colleague to quote some of his words and photos. It's very funny to give us an elaborated script of the differences among the three. Nix is wearing the smart mustache. 
the S8 is getting a scar. It is estimated iPhone is getting the long beard. It looks not as handsome as I expected. That, just for your reference, I do appreciate Arthur. Thank you for his support. His name is Ai Bing Yuzhou. In the first generation, we provided your concept smartphone and we are lodging the screen as much as possible. The purpose is to give you a great sense of astonishment. However, we heard some rumors. It is not good for the hands, the so-called hand feel. At the second generation, we are going to provide you a great product with superb hand feel. 5.99 inch is of our option, almost 6 inches. How do you find it? Big or appropriate? 5.99 sounds quite big. But please hold for a sec. Compared to Mix 6.4, it is 11.9% smaller in the body. 2.5% thinner, 11.5% lighter. As a wrap up, it's quite similar to the typical iPhone. Compared to 7 Plus of iPhone, it's 7% smaller. Mix 2 will be giving you superb feeling. It is the 5.5 inch smartphone with narrow bezels. We will update it on Sunday. We care about the width of the smartphone. 5.99 inch full screen size is equivalent of the 5.5 inch typical smartphone. 18 to 9 full screen is also equivalent of the typical 16 to 9 smartphone. We need to spend some time to educate our clients. But now you must be having that feeling. It's not that big as you expect. Here comes appearance or the design of the smartphone. 18 to 9 will give you great vision. Ultra thin frame in metal. The super black in color will be giving you a great aesthetic feeling. To give you the complete black sense, when we are plating, plating the camera, we are using the super black lens coating. It's really a tough tech. You turn it off, it looks like a whole piece. Here comes the ceramic body with concave with curve. And we are using the 18K plated gold. And here comes the composition photo for the rear part and the front part. We using 7 series aluminum frame provides you the light and strong feeling. Here comes the performance. We are using the Snapdragon 835. Weeks ago, I attended a conference and I get one of the slides which was really striking. The Snapdragon 800 series is seeing 66% of the shipment in China without Xiaomi. The Snapdragon 800 or any other flagship smartphone should never be materialized. We are making contribution to the flagship smartphone in China. We know that the 800 chips 
are frequently consumed by other brands, 66%. Without our effort, you are not going to have such strong performing smartphones. The current is sharing off with the fact. But I hope that they're not going to anger the rest of the market. But we have to line up to the fact. We did a lot to improve the involvement of the whole industry. The next is about the taking photos. While using the flagship level photo taking skills. 1.25 Umi big pixels is chosen with the anti-shake optical technologies. It looks really bizarre compared to the first generation, compared to the protocol and concept design. The Mix 2 is a real flagship smartphone. The color, the details, and the sharp contrast are obvious. Here are some of these sample photos. It looks gorgeous. It was taken at the Forbidden City uh, Watchtower. We also went to Taiwan to get stabbed at the palace. And here is the 101 Tower in Taipei. We went to New York to have a bird view of the Manhattan. It's like we are watching a big movie, a blockbuster. Here comes the texture of the mixture. What about the experience? At the first generation, we received a lot of complaints about the dialogue. And now, still rem please remember the breakthrough we did. It contains advantages and disadvantages. We did Mix 2 as a flagship smartphone. The quality of communication of making call should be prioritized. At the first generation, we're using the Canty level pyroelectric semi-rig acoustic technology. This sound resonates through the metal frame and is delivered through the screen. This tech is superb. However, when you are making calls, the smartphone should never be giving you good privacy. The person who is closing to you will hear what you are talking about. In the concept smartphone, we will, we will take all disruptive technologies while with the defects. Our team is moving ahead and we are in the hope of getting rid of the privacy issue. At the second generation, we are concerned about using mature acoustic technologies. So what's the solution? We moved up the speaker higher and higher, and we made a guided tube next to it. We used the traditional sound unit, but it's minimized. So we used a, a mini a, a power speaker, and the speaker is of high power, and then we used a sound guiding tube, which delivers the same sound quality as a traditional system. But when you look at the phone, it's like the speakers have disappeared, and that has required a lot of efforts of our designers. And apart from that optimization, we optimized the phone design for the business professionals. And one of the great services we provide is global bands. We provide global bands on our smartphones. You often see Xiaomi as a start up and think maybe we don't have it as well-established technologies as some of our peer companies, but we have invested heavily into technologies over the years, and one of it is global bands. Well, last year when we launched Note 2 Global Edition, we supported six most and 37 bands. And this year, we went one step forward. 
Now we support six modes and 43 bands. Well, that's your applause. Maybe you don't really understand the significance of 43 bands. But I still don't. I'm not sure that you really understand the significance of 43 bands. Well, actually, me too. I didn't know the difference between 43 and 37 bands. Now, but now we support uh, the networks in 226 countries and regions around the world. So we basically support the network in all the countries and regions in the world. And now let's look at our peer companies. Well, iPhone 7 Plus in China support 37 bands and Samsung S8 33 and Huawei P10 32 before Xiaomi with support almost all bands in the world. Well, we got 90, 95, and 98 points out of 100, and we also got 100 points from one of the viewers. Well, there is a lot of difference between these points. Well, we did all the tests in the laboratories for the global bands, but can the global bands really work on on the ground. Well, in the past few months, our engineers went to almost 100 countries in the world to field test whether the phone can really support the local carrier network service. They went to Spain, Japan, France. They even went to the pyramid in the desert. What a hard job for the engineers. And when I was uh, writing the PowerPoint, I was thinking, well, that's a really hard job. Maybe I should do it instead of the engineers. Or we should send our me fans to do the field test instead. And we'll probably have more and more volunteers who will like to sign up for the field test. And that's how what I was thinking when I was working on my PowerPoint. There are a lot of interesting jobs in Xiaomi, even though they had to travel to 100 countries in a couple of months. But those countries seem very interesting and many of them even I haven't been to so it's really great journey to work in Xiaomi so I can say with great pride that Xiaomi makes to provide global bands for our business professionals because it covers almost all carrier network services in the world and also we have another good service which is called global network accessibility so when you travel abroad you don't need to buy a local sim card we can give you a virtual sim card this service covers 68 countries and regions in the world and the service is very affordable as well and during the golden week in october first week the price is only 6.6 .6 rmb every day and unlimited data okay in hong kong is 5.5 rmb uh, Macau 6.6, .6, Taiwan 6.6, .6, and Thailand 5.5, Europe 5.5, and Australia 5.5 per day. So if you plan to travel during the Golden Week in October, please buy a mix to phone and help us with the field test. And at the same time, you can feel the seamless internet accessibility on our phone. No rush. We also have a 4x4 four four MIMO antenna. We support LTE 4 uh, channel antenna technology and we uh, can give you very fast network access. Uh, access. We also support multi-function NFC. I often joke that this is our family legacy because we started it five years ago and in this industry we have been the groundbreaker because NFC can be used as a metro card and, uh, and as a 
payment uh, credit card. And so these are the technologies we have worked on over the years. Now we support high-speed tray mode, and we also uh, support chipset level spoofing detection. So you see how much efforts we have made on communications technologies. And another function that we like to mention here is uh, very interesting because we know business professionals often uh, use uh, voice recorders to record meetings to help them with mit meeting minutes afterwards. But people who use recorders most are journalists. On well, this time, we used the professional audio recording technology in Mix2. It supports dual ADC HD audio recording. You can sit four meters away from the speaker and the sound quality is as good as when you are sitting right next to the speaker. Well, first it helps with uh, the professionals who need to write the meeting minutes. And, and also this is a present to our friends from the press who have supported us along the way and that helped them to record the interviews and meetings. And how good is it? Let's look at a video clip. You will be surprised. Okay, so the best products don't always come from abroad. Don't blindly follow foreign brands. Well, it's just a small function that we added to the main too. We want to make sure that you have the best audio recording uh, function here. And price. Well, last year, Mix was sold at 3,499 RMB. It had a 17 by 9 full screen display and the 4 gigabytes plus uh, 128 gigabytes, 300, 499 gigabytes. And the price mostly uh, came from the cost of the full ceramic body. Well, and it was a concept phone. I think we had room for improvement, but our users really liked the the price. They never complained about the price of Mix, and they said Mix is the only phone that people complained because it's not expensive enough. And that was the hottest comment that we received on social media. And they said the mix was um, not expensive enough for its performance. So yesterday, I was thinking about it, how to price our mix two. Let's look at uh, the summary of mix two compared with, with mix one. We have 18 by 9 screen and the best configurations. We have Snapdragon 835, starts with 6 gigabyte RAM, and we have 4 axis optical image stabilization, support global LTE bands, and we have a 4 by 4 MIMO and 4 channel antenna technology, which means top performance you can see in the market. So we did some market survey about pricing and some internet users said, I really hope that the price should be higher than 4,000 RMB because it's a good phone. It should be expensive. Well, we received a lot of different feedback from uh, different users and uh, these suggestions actually show um, their understanding of a Xiaomi's values, but their understanding is not the same as ours because we want always want to manufacture the best phone with the best affordability. So we had a lot of discussions internally about their pricing. Well, last night we finally agreed to the price. Well, indeed, we can make it more expensive, but a friendly and affordable price is our commitment to me fans because we always want to be the affordable brand that can reach the heart of every user and that is our value proposition and we will never stray away from what we believe in.
And apart from the mix too, apart from this version, we have the uh, 3,599 for 129 gigabytes and 3,999 for 256 gigabytes. So you can see prices for different uh, uh, storage options. And because we have four-sided uh, curved ceramic body, the rigidity is quite high, so is the toughness, and also is anti-slippery. We also give as a uh, complementary present, uh, which is a ultra-slim protection case, and it's a, a present uh, given for free. It's in the uh, package. Apart from the full screen display technology, Xiaomi has been working hard on the mass production and application of the high density ceramic manufacturing process, which is often seen as a family legacy of Xiaomi. Well, last year we launched Mix, which is equipped with full ceramic body. Well, how was that made? We made a 2.5D uh, back case and a ceramic uh, middle frame. And last year the cost of these two pieces was 1,400 RMB. The price of the the phone was 3,499, but the cost for these two pieces alone were as much as 1,400 RMB, so it was very challenging for us. But now we evolved the technology into four sided ceramics. So uh, now the ceramics themselves are curved. But what we truly want to bring to our users is to make a body with one single piece of uh, highly dense ceramics. So just think about it. If you have one phone that is made of one single piece of ceramics, it will be as transparent and beautiful as a piece of jade. It's really very hot. Today I'm going to introduce to you what we have been doing to present to you the final good result. Let's go and have a look the full ceramic special edition of Xiaomi. By using a complete piece of ceramics, you are going to have the really superb product. It looks amazing. The name of the tech, actually within our company we had a heat discussion to name it. It looks very long in the beginning for ceramic, ceramic body. Now we shorten down to the uni body ceramic. I'm not a, a native speaker. I cannot give you a perfect term. I'm a Chinese. But I'm still failed to give you a good Chinese name, unibody ceramic or unibody food ceramic will give you all the stories behind. Unibody, please, any of you, give me a good Chinese word. Now, please go back and have an even closer look. It's like a whole piece of jade. In white, astonishing. We are prototype and we have products for exhibition. Please join us after this presentation. The boys may prefer the unibody for ceramic products in white, in black. Beautiful, isn't it? This 
It's, it's really going beyond the languages. It's like a perfect jade from heaven. It's an art piece, more than a commodity. Behind all those gorgeous products, we have to go through ups and downs. Here are all the difficulties we overcome for each unibody for ceramic is going to go through 7, 1,700 Celsius sintering within seven days. Even if we are sporting a grazing, we will raise the whole batch. How could a, a piece of grazing come about? We know that ceramic has strong density during Sintering without a proper density, it will create cracking, crazing, different types of problems. Uh, even a small hole looks like a ghost. It takes us a lot of time and energy until we could figure it out. The secret behind is now listed on the slide. We are using a dry pressing technology to increase the density by using a two tower height equipment with 240 tons. We made it happen. It looks beyond your imagination. The density is pretty high in order to prevent the cracks or the crazy. Even by using this high tech, we do not have a, a, good, a lot of good products. The next is we are using the precisely crafted silicon carpet, and we have to use the great drill. The drill is made up of silicon carpet. Every 0 0.01 millimeter is precisely crafted. During the processing, after we are finishing one piece of the uni piece, we are going to change for a new drill. Seven days is the duration. After that, we are going to have a 10 hour polish until we have the product. And we have the fourth test. It's not that easy, it's really hard. It's going beyond your expectation and imagination. And now, price. Let's go back, have a look at the parameters of the configurations compared to the typical ones. We have two major parts. The first is the unibody for ceramic body. It's really expensive. The second is the G8 GB Super RAM. It's artwork. We had fierce discussion on the pricing for the high cost. After rounds of calculation and discussion, we drew the conclusion. And I'm going to hear your feedback. We want to be the craftsman and we are benchmarking with the top products. With the only purpose is to lower the price to have a wide range of presence. We want to reach out consumers as many as possible. Everyone from the whole market could enjoy the beauty of the new technologies. Now, here is a uni body product, not just for you. It is a product, it is smart for the future. It contains 18 to 9 4 screen display, four sided curved ceramic body. Mr. Philip Stark is invited to finish the design. He is a top and recognized industrial designer. We know he is a master. Now, a piece of video from Philip. Mixture is designed by 
master, Philip Stark. After his work, he gave us the recognition. Mix is a nearly perfect smartphone. Today, we're very honored to invite Mr. Philip Stark on the stage. Now, let's welcome him. See, are you okay? <laughs> I am okay, but the most important. Are you okay? <laughs> okay. Uh, on behalf of all the audiences on side, I have two questions for you. The first question is, Mix 2 is the second product of partnership with Mr. Philip Stark. And the first one is, this is your second time of cooperation with Xiaomi. And how do you feel about it? I feel very well. I feel very comfortable. Because I have the deep feeling to work with the best company. We try to work a lot to give you the best, to give the best to everybody. That's why human intelligence always try to give the best with the less. That means giving the best, the most powerful, the most faster, the most intelligent with the less materiality. It's smaller, but it's wider. It's more intelligent, it's better for everything, for everybody. This is my best design. It's already at the top of my design. It's such a big screen, but it's even bigger. It makes your hand and hand feel better. The full screen is the best design for the best design. It's not an evolution. It's the best design for the best design. 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 Plus the addition of evolution that make a revolution. Because 18 by 9, it's natural, it's human, it's our real proportion of landscape. Ah, because 18 by 9, this ratio is more close to nature. A ratio that makes people feel more comfortable when they use it. They feel more comfortable. That's why we can start to speak about harmony. Harmony for the eyes. Ah, 和谐呢是贴近你的一个视觉上的一个效果 Harmony for the ears with the new quality of sound. Harmony for the spirit and for the end with the unibody ceramic. It's magic like an old Chinese jade, a type of serenity. You know, in a society where everything goes so fast, seven days to guarantee you the absolute quality, because this one is the peak of intelligence, this one is the ultimate. You can trust us, you, tr you can trust him, we shall always find better and better and better to find the best. Another question that I have. Stark has worked with us on two models. And just a good friend with our engineers and designers. You have been working with us since like two years ago. And how you feel about our engineer team and our product team? You know, a product like that cannot be the design of only one person. It's the result of a team. I many company, I work with the best company of the world. But I can guarantee you, the best engineers are in Xiaomi. The best designers are in Xiaomi. It's true. It's true. 
可以向你们保证，全世界最好的公司、最好的团队、最好的工程师就在小米。And I have to thank them. I have to thank you because without you, without us, this miracle is not possible. But the biggest surprise was I know Li Jun is a fantastic engineer. 呃，我其实知道雷总呢，雷军呢是一个工程师。I is also a design genius. 但是他确实是一个设计天才。And it's a problem for me. 这对我是一个挑战。Because finally, he's better than me. 呃，我知道。Okay, uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, take a big picture. Sounds really yes. nice to the ears. Okay. With pleasure. Bye, Tim. And I can't throw it to you. It will break. Okay, once again, thank you very much, Mr. Philip Stark. Okay. We have an exhibition outside the uh, stadium, and you can go and take a look of uh, these uh, phones that we launched today. So that's the launch of Mix Two, and another star of the day. Mi Note three. Yes, you're right. So this side uh, year in a. Pearl, we launched a Mi 6, which was well received uh, in the market and um, was too uh, greatly demanded by the market. And people often say that uh, they, uh, it's picture perfect and uh, it's some users complain it's hard to buy it because there is not enough supply. And they also say it would be better if the screen is larger. And that is why this time, we launch a Mi 6, which is much larger than the previous model, and it has a 5.15 inch and 5.5. The previous one is 5.15, and this one is 5.5 inch, and is made of a, a dreamy four-sided curved display, and has metal frame and flat dual camera uh, with a very uh, slim body. Is beautiful, and people often say that Mi Six is really beautiful, and this is a larger Mi Six. And uh, favorite color for our male users uh, black, and we have four-sided black glass, and it looks seamless. And when we designed the phone, we used ultra uh, narrow uh, size. Well, iPhone 7 has 3.7 millimeter of size, but for us, we, ours is only 3.6 milliliters, and the chin is much smaller as well. And compared to Max 2 and iPhone 7, it's, uh, the phone itself is one size smaller, but the hand feel is excellent. So if you like smaller screens, then go for it. Me. Uh, Me Note 3 is your series. 
aluminum alloy uh, frame. So why 7 series uh, aluminum alloy? Well, for Mi 6, we used uh, stainless steel, but now we use uh, the 7 series aluminum alloy. So why? Well, over the years, we um, are manufacturing with metal in industry, and then there are three mainstream materials. First is uh, 6 series aluminum, and which is also used to some of our products, but there is a problem with the 6 series. It's easy to manufacture and it has a very nice appearance, but the rigidity and toughness is the problem. That is why now we replace that with 7 series, which is more difficult in manufacturing and higher in cost. But we are a team of engineers and designers. iPhone 4 used stainless steel, and so we think we can also design with stainless steel. That's why with the Mi S4, we used stainless steel, but we had a disaster with the supply of materials. A few years later, and we thought it would be OK for us to use stainless steel in Mi six but there were a lot of complications in supply including uh, not su enough supply from uh, uh, snapdragon a35 and insufficient supply of stainless steel well when stainless steel is used with four-sided uh, curved ceramics and glass bodies very difficult to make the rounded corners well our goal is to have a a side of only 0.1 millimeter and that is very difficult and now we want to make sure that the quality is not compromised because of manufacturing so uh, that posed a lot of challenges for us and against that backdrop when we designed note 3 we decided to make sure there are always sufficient stock for the users. We want to deliver products to the users. And so that has been our priority over the past few months. So after careful deliberations, we decided to go with 7 series aluminum alloy. It is much easier than stainless steel and much better in quality compared to Series 6. We see that Opal R11, Huawei P10 use 6 series and Xiaomi 6 use stainless steel and iPhone 7 Plus and Mi Note 3 use 7 series aluminum alloy. Well, it's easier to manufacture compared to stainless steel and also it's lighter and tougher. So that's why we made a balanced choice considering the toughness, rigidity and supply and stock and we have a 3,500 mAh of battery and compared with iPhone 7 Plus is 25 grams lighter. So then hand feel, the size, the weights are all very excellent and later when you go to the exhibition outside, please try to feel it and feel the outstanding uh, feeling in your hand. So. That is a Mi Note 3. And also for the camera, we use um, the same uh, dual camera modules as was used in uh, Mi 6. So we have a 12 megapixel wide angle, 12 megapixel a telephoto, and the same technology as Apple. We have a, a twice a, a optical zoom and it offers very good camera photos even in dim light as well as blurred backgrounds and we have four axis OIS technology and so the hardware of Note 3 is absolutely the same as Mi 6 hardware wise and so now let's look at the reviews we have received well in June this year we asked the not transition authority for a survey and uh, lots of photos were taken with uh, the uh, Huawei P10 and uh, iPhone 7 Plus and Mi uh, Note 3. So for the same scenes, the three phone models would take photos and the photos would be uploaded to a platform for users to choose which one they like the best. Well, actually 63% of users chose pictures taken by Mi 
six, which means me six had better performance of、uh, photography. And after half year of recalibration and upgradation of the algorithms, the cameras of me note three is even better. And I would like to give you a detail. We provide the more accurate edge detection, and we'll provide you even better blurred background or the bokeh background. We know that we need to provide you good comparison. Now we're going to find out which photo is taken by us, which photos by our competitors. If we zoom large, Note Three will give you better facial expression, better feelings, and better face complexity. We know that the difficulty in the camera is more about your personal feeling, and you don't have the exact parameters to calculate the figures. Each brand takes it for granted. We did the best, but now we are hiring around a hundred professional photographers to do the blind test. A hundred professional photographers under 5px were invited. They did a voting. 70 percent of the professionals did say we did the best. Note three. We are high on the rating. We are moving from six. 30, 63% to 72%. Within six months, we did it very fast, with great result. Xiaomi 6 will be receiving all the optimization of the hardware. We are changing tuning and algorithm. But still, a little problem is facing us. Xiaomi 6 is giving us the slogan of "We are using the dual camera with optical camera," and we are having the slogan of "Improve dual camera algorithm with person perfect with picture with picture perfect." But now we're using. Even more perfect. However, this slogan was not allowed by the law of the commercials. I will give you my new version, as the previous one was not allowed. By using Note Three, the person who is in the photo looks more beautiful. It's amazing. I did appreciate it. Was dear changed and optimized the tuning and the camera. I like it. I'm not new speaker English, but I'm really good at Chinese. The person who's in the photo looks more beautiful. With Note Three, we elaborated on the strengths of Note Three. I'll give you some of the samples. Here comes a street photo in Taipei. Quite natural. And we are targeting the specialized digital camera. In the central park of New York, you can distinguish the differences in the past, but now it's really an arduous task to tell the differences. We went to Venice Movie Festival. We take some photos for some stars. The lady Madame Lu Jinshan in the wall, the wall, the wall fair too. She was in the movie Crash. Madame Jinshan. He's a young star. The Chinese ambassador of focus, Madame Xu Jiao. She went to. And became the cast of the number seven of the Yangtze River. How do you find the quality of the photo, the performance of our Note Three? 
Now here comes the configuration of the Note 3. We are using the Snapdragon 616 and we are using Quantum High End Processor. We know that our competitor is also using this with good performance. We are using the 14 nanometer technology octa core processor. Here comes the standardized 6GB RAM. At this moment, 6GB RAM will be weird to you, but we all know as a professional. Within the last year, the cost of the RAM is skyrocketing. In this Q4, the cost will be increasing as well and it will be maintained even in the Q1 of 2018. Now we are using 6GB RAM and we are a good company with great corporation responsibility. We are using the 5.5 eye protection screen. It is our heritage to use 5.5 inch screen. Over the past five to six years, they were using different types of technologies, such as a negative LCD comparison and the Blu-ray eye protection screen the one night super dark screen and 4096 smart black lead modification. We hired a team. To this specifically, and each of the technology has been worked out year after year. This is a multifunctional NFC. We did use it for the past five years and we made advances. It supported the card, the transportation multiple in one card. All the transportation card are getting standardized as long as you have one, as it supports the multiple card in one. Node 3 makes 2, Xiaomi 6 will be giving you a great scan. Previously, we did support different types of transportation cards back cars and etc. The multifunctional NFC is moving ahead with its support to the transportation card. And here comes Steve speaker. Xiaomi Note 3 could be recognized as a bigger screen Xiaomi 6. It looks really amazing. We know that we're in an era where people do like things perfect and beautiful. The beautiful faces will be recognized by our smartphones as well. And here is one function, the face unlocking, the facial recognition. This is an AI-based facial recognition. Over the past two to three years, we made great strides stride forward. It's quite safe with efficiency. In Xiaomi Note 3, we did launch this tag. Take it. It will turn it on with sex. Have a try. Let's find out speed. You take it in front of a face and your smartphone could be working. We did a test. It is fast as the fingerprint unlocking. However, we need extra move to print to put your finger on this spot. Facial unlock is quite special when your hands are wet. We know that some persons have really shallow fingerprint, hard to be recognized by the smartphone. When you are washing your hands or when your hands are wet, it's really hard for the smart smartphones to do this. Now, you are having the wet hands, you will fail. It does not work. On other occasion, in the olden time, 
It's really good that in the winter time we have a special gloves in the name of the touchpad gloves. By wearing the gloves, you are going to use the smartphones. But still, it looks awkward because the gloves will not help you to turn on your smartphone. Let's have a look. You're not going to use your fingerprint anymore. That by our smartphone, just stay close with our smartphone via your facial expressions. In Xiaomi Note 3, we did improvements on taking the selfie. We support 60 million front cameras. Any advantages from this side in the daytime? The selfies will make you look quite clear in the evening. The selfies will help you to reduce the noises. And this is a 4-in-1 to you unimeter pixels with limited numbers of noise. The 60 million pixel in the daytime will be having 400 composition pixel. Three years ago, when Note 1 was launched, we are using two Yumi composite big pixel with good effects. But at that moment, we are just having 4 million, but our competitors was given 60 million, but actually the 400 million we have were given the customer better experience with higher cost. It's about marketing. Actually, we are targeting the 6 million pixels with two Yumi camera. It's not only about pixels. 5 million, 8 million, 12 million, and 30 million. More importantly, we have to understand the size of each of the pixel. It will impact the quality of the photo. In Note 3, we're using 60 million pixels. Well, in the daytime, we have the 4 million composite pixels into Yumi. And here comes the comparison between NOS and iPhone. Now, let's forget it. The selfie of iPhone was not that good. The domestic products is outperforming that of iPhone. Hardware is on one hand for smartphone. The other part is the tuning software, and we did a lot to improve the function of the beautification. This is the typical beautification result. Radical toning, radical smoothing. It looks quite blurred. At the end of last year, we did raise up a question. Are we going to take the job as a makeup professional to give you detailed and personalized makeup? It's really a complex side for all these steps to finish the makeup. We know this. Perhaps some of us know part of this. We know part of the steps. We know the lipsticks, we know the eyelash pen, we know that the facial masks. When I prepare the slides, I get something new. Have you ever heard the BB or the CC lo lotion? Or have you ever heard of the concealer? concealer? Step by step, I'm not going to read out all the names. Yesterday, I asked the help of several experts, but we are missing the eyeliner. But eyeliner is not included. We have at least 12 steps. We could go longer. As a technician, it's going to have us exhausted. Let us have AI beautification or adaptive beautification. Let the robots to learn. Let our smartphone become your personalized professional to have the makeup. We spent half a year to hit our objective. Now this is a primer. 
Why are you going to have this step? AI is going to identify different colors. And we are going to improve your complexion based on your status and go into different, different algorithms. And what about the function of the primer? She's a bit yellowish, so she needs a purple primer. And for the lady in the middle whose uh, skin is more pinkish, then she she needs a green primer, and the lady to the right needs a natural complexion. Well, take a look. They all look prettier. So primer is very important. That's the moral behind the story. It helps to correct the complexion. And the second step, foundation. And for guys, it's like just adding powder to the face, but that's not it. It's not that simple. So first of all, you need to separate uh, the face into different sections. There is the T section, and there is the cheekbones and the chin, and that's the best uh, application for AI. So the TI can analyze for the T section around the eyebrows and the nose bridge. It means less glossy. Uh, lights and then it helps to remove the dark bags and the algorithm is so strong that it, it, it can remove the, the dark bags while at the same time you know keeping the lying silkworms do you know what lying silkworms are so look at the traditional smoothing to the left and look at ours after it removes the dark circles it actually keeps the lying silkworms which is the symbol of beauty and also concealers we have a concealer function in the beautify uh, cameras so the software helps to conceal uh, the acne and pimples on the skin while keeping the details of eyebrows and also for some local areas in the face it helps to uh, whitening and brightening the skin so the skin will look very moisturized and uh, lots of uh, beautify cameras only focus on the face and forget the necks and then it looks very strange and uh, our beautify camera beautifies both the face and the neck and we are attentive to details for example you uh, can change the color of the iris as if you're wearing colored contact lenses and also it has the function of adding lip glosses lipsticks while keeping the natural lines on the lips and also for the thinning effects we first establish a 3d model of the bone structure and set up at 226 bone points and then thin and slim the chin line naturally and the face after being beautified wouldn't look artificial or triangular and look at our effect to the right it looks very natural but the one to the left look a bit triangular We did a lot of research into the beautiful function of the camera and Robin Drew is the chief designer in our company and he is the uh, he ranks the third uh, in terms of uh, handsomeness in our company and after he put his photo into the beautiful camera this is how he looks and I was joking with him that you're so beautiful that your mom can't even recognize you now so that's what a beautify camera does to a guy and that's the result of our half a year of efforts so I realized the algorithm for a guy and a girl should be separate that's why we came up with beautify camera for guys and first of all for the bone structure it needs to be more three-dimensional and it needs to have the heart have mainly lines around the chin and also the details of the beard or mustache should be kept 
Only in that way will guys look natural after being beautified with a camera. And we have a video clip to introduce to you、uh, of our beautified camera. Samples taken by our beautified cameras. Lu Jingshan, actress from、uh, War Wolf Two. It's like the photo is retouched. And Jingchen, a selfie from Venice. Xu Jiao, selfie from Venice. I was very excited to see our effects because if far. It was far beyond what I had expected. So, how did we、uh, come up with the uh, AI uh, beautify camera? Well, last year we established a badass team, and they are cross-disciplinary. And some of them have background in products, some in hardware and software, camera, algorithm, artificial intelligence, and design, and other sectors. So it is definitely the most badass team we have in Xiaomi, and they are really professional. And it is precisely due to the close collaboration between different departments and teams that we have achieved the AI algorithm for the beautify camera because the. Camera involves expertise in different disciplines, and they also need to learn how to do makeups. So we got the most professional makeup artists to train them, and the artists from Dongtian, which is a top fashion brand in China, and that's one of the perks we provide our employees. So how did they work around the AI、uh, for beauty camera? Well, every day,、uh, 100 million photos are taken by. Me users, and after we receive the photos, what do we do is to、uh, hire a、uh, photo retoucher, a very famous one who usually work for celebrities, and he、uh, he then retouched all the photos that were taken by our users. And this retoucher and the photo actually worked for Chen Man Studio. You know, he has been working on. Photos of celebrities for many years. Only when we have professional retouchers like him can we、uh, best improve our、uh, technology. So I think we definitely are the industry leader when it comes to beautify camera in the world. And now let's hear from the team how they feel. So the AI-based beautify camera is much more complicated than it looks. But this time, we're determined that the AI beautify camera must be、uh, top of the art, and that is why we have invested so much. And、uh, the result. Was- and for such a gorgeous phone, we need a gorgeous spokesperson. So in the end, we decided to invite Chris Wu as our spokesperson, and on Weibo, the Chinese microblog,、um, I saw that、um, and they are very.、Uh, They really welcomed the launch of the film, but Chris Wu is now on a business trip in the U.S. That's why he can't be here today. But he has a the poster. Do you like it? Our marketing department didn't take my suggestion, so this is our slogan, which is a beautiful selfie and. Prettier portraits, and so Chris Wu took millions of great selfies and photos with our smartphone. I do adore this slogan, especially the period, the special period. So we decided to take this photo to be our main poster. For roadshow, Chris Wu is also working with us.
it's like 30 seconds and we're going let's go back and to see all the figurations and it is a bigger xiaomi 6 with the 60 million pixel AI beautification function, IA Blaster facial recognition, unlocking stereo speakers, 5.5 display with breathing mode, underglass fingerprint sensor. Again, the dual camera with optical zoom, the snapshot, the Snapdragon, and 6 GB RAM, the 7 series aluminum alloy metal frame and four sided curved glass body. Now let's do a comparison. I'll choose one. Now we have the 6 GB. RM. As long as we know that the cost of the member is pretty high, the second advantage lies in the camera. Again, we have the dual camera with optical zoom, and we have the NFC as well as the four-sided curved body, glass body. Their price is 2,909. We are at 2,499. It's worthwhile. Now the memory is really skyrocketing and we could maintain the retail price. We have three options for you. 6 GB plus 46 GB light black and 4 G 12 GB light black. They priced at 2,499 and 200, 800. 2,899 respectively. The most expensive one is 2,999. It's really handsome. But I'm not a fan of the red color. Which one do you prefer? The blue one and the red one? Red one. Oh. You prefer the one I the photo and perhaps next time I will be the spokesperson the, per the reason is I'm more expensive then the marketing department failed to pay me so I decided to ask Chris Wu to take my place now here comes the most suffering period <laughs> opening purchase it's been for the past six to seven years since I did Xiaomi Prior I did this, I have good reputation in the market. Ever since I did the job, I was blamed, I was criticized for the reason of open purchase. And the microblog, this photo was very popular. I'm the big brother. I'm a tough person with limited choices of the products. Two days ago, I did a survey on the pricing 4,000 above. And among the almost 1,000 audiences, two made a comment, you give me the product right now. I did apologize to all of you. We are a company of no more than seven years of the history. It is a startup company. We need to prepare a lot of inventory, but it's really hard for us to do this. Before the launch, only Apple and Samsung, Samsung could do one 10 million units in inventory, but we did make progress continuously. We are not doing the so-called hungry sales. Over the previous years, we are not that strong in manufacturing or holding the smartphones. Yesterday, we took photo in our warehouse. Probably, it will run out of sales immediately, but in the past six years, we did make progress. I do appreciate all the support from the hardware development department. I'm a one of the official, Mr. Yen, is with me. 
I do appreciate his support. And Vice President Mr. Zhang Feng from the supply chain is also worth my respect. Such a big number of inventory is materialized for their support. Um, the morning, in the morning of 10th September, they did give me the number. Not very big, but they filled these storehouses. Xiaomi Note 3 will be for purchase tomorrow. Tomorrow, you'll be having the smartphone. 8 o'clock in the evening, you're going to take at most one unit. 8 o'clock in the evening, if you are lucky enough to log on our website, in the 2 o'clock of tomorrow's afternoon, you'll have it. Some information for Mix 2. Mix 2 is a full screen display 2.0 role, disruptive technologies, get new involvement. It's all about screen and it's for the global band. It's really expensive. It's Mix 2. For the first launch Friday, this Friday. On September 15th, in the morning of 10 o'clock, it's going to start sales. And in this evening, 8 o'clock, we take your order. Also, the same rule, one person, one unit. Xiaomi Mix 2, the special edition, will be launched in this November. I do hope that the better the product, the later it will come. It it's worthwhile your waiting. Now, it's the last part of my presentation. I'm going to give you some of the gifts and souvenirs. Mija, thank you to be our sponsor for a long while. The first gift, Mija, we have finally crafted a scroll toolkit. It's your great companion, whether you are stay home or go for traveling. For a technician, it's really finely crafted Sura. At the price of 99, Weha is a brand. It is made in Germany, and we could say it is a luxury brand among the Sura blade. And we are providing the aluminum alloy container, 24 Weha drillers, and great aluminum alloy handles. It is a Lux Rice, the luxury car brand. The second gift, Major Eye House parameter is for non-contact purpose. It was born for detecting the fever. If you are developing fever, please take our product. Eye House Major parameter is also your daily companion. Be you are at home or go away. Place it in the mid of your forehead. The result will be collected. They are really outstanding and I do appreciate their sponsorship. Okay, let's go back and walk through the three products. Xiaomi Mix 2, Xiaomi Note 3 and Xiaomi Mix 2. And Xiaomi Pro, a notebook, and we have the exhibition area at the corridor. At the end of this presentation, please join us and have a closer look. If you do like it, please help us to send photos in the front circle of the WeChat. Thank you very much for attending.